If you could sum up the pandemic in three words, what would they be? Uh, extreme. Extreme, okay. And hard. Hard. And one more word. Weird. Yeah, weird. <laughs> so are you ready to answer some questions about the pandemic? Pretty sure, yeah. What's up and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today's video is going to be me interviewing an expert on the pandemic, which is actually my little brother, Max. This is the like fourth time he's been on my YouTube channel. He's like so popular on my channel, but he actually has his own YouTube channel called The Happy Center. So go subscribe to him. He does like cute little therapy videos. As a seven year old, he gives really good advice. And also if you want to see our sibling tag, that will be right here. But anyway, let's get into the video because I have some questions to ask him about the pandemic because he's very smart. Question one, what was your first thought when you heard about the coronavirus on the news? that it was gonna be hard to deal with. Hard to deal with, yeah. Like when you saw it on TV, were you? did you think it was gonna be a big deal? Yeah, I thought it was gonna be a big deal and hard to get rid of, kind of. Yeah. What makes you the most upset about this pandemic? Um, well, just the cases, people dying. <laughs> yeah, pretty obvious. Do you think there's anything that could change the way the pandemic's going? Like anything that could stop the spread? Yeah, maybe a new vaccine. Something to get rid of it, like a vaccine, you know. And also people wearing masks, just something to prevent it from, you know, spreading. Yeah. Okay, so currently when I'm filming this, it is August 8th, uh, 2020. So when do you think that things are going to go back to normal? Mm. Like what month, year? I'd say about five to seven months. So in like... Six months. That seems about right. What are you the most scared of like about this virus? Well, I'm just scared about the cases and dying. Yeah. And the people I love dying. Do you like wearing a mask? It's kind of okay. I don't really like it, but I'll, I'll, I'll do it to stop deaths and cases. Same here. Describe the incredibly hard hand washing process that we have to go through nowadays. Well, first, you go like this with your thumbs. Then you go like this. You wash the top of your thumbs. Then you put your nails here and here. Then you go like this. Then you wash this and this. And then you dry. It's a big process. Oh yeah. How do you feel about doing school online this year as opposed to in person? Well, I think it's a little weird, but it's basically the same. You know, you learn stuff, the teacher gives you facts about stuff. You know, <laughs> Pretty much sums it up. Are you sad because, like, you won't be able to make new friends or you won't be able to see your well, friends? Well, you can still make friends online. True, if you get their number and they actually give you your number back and they don't reject you. So, you think online school is going to be a good experience this year? Or, like, what? Well... I don't know, it, it, it will be because if like the, somebody's annoying the teacher and not getting her teach, she can just put them on mute and you won't hear Exactly. Her. So what is your favorite like program for all of the like Zoom class calls? Like do you like Zoom or Google Meet? I think Zoom's the best because you know, you get all of these people together, you know, you can have all these people together. Like Skype, it's it's okay, but it can only allow a few amount of people. But yeah. Zoom can allow a lot. Yeah. What is one good thing that has happened to you during the pandemic? Hmm. Oh, I do have now moving mornings and movie nights with my um aunt. our family yes yeah. uh so now that we are in quarantine and everything we have time to like have movie mornings and movie nights and really connect with our family yeah. and we've also gotten into really good shape because okay. now we have time to exercise because we used to be in school all day but now yeah. we like have time to exercise what is one bad thing that has happened to you during the pandemic that is gonna be hard to say because it's so long but Honestly, same. <laughs> Just name like a couple things. Ooh, I know. 
But having to see the cases going up and up and up. Yep. I'm not able to play baseball. I'm not a, a, a able to go out and have a, fa- a nice family gathering dinner. Yeah. I mean. He used to go out and wear like the cutest little suits, and my yeah. family and I would eat out at restaurants all the time, and he'd like dress up and like pretend he's like going to a fancy I formal dinner. But now I don't have to. Yeah, now we can't. If you could give one piece of advice to people, like at all of us going through the pandemic right now, what would it be? Um, I think wear a mask and try to stay at home, you know, just to help the environment somehow. Yeah. Be kind to everyone because we're not, you're not just going through this, we all are. Good advice. Oh, and also tell why you should wear masks. Oh, you should wear masks to protect the spread of others and you. Yeah, because apparently, and this is scientifically proven, but masks don't just protect you, they protect other people. So if you don't wear one, you're not taking care of your fellow citizens, right? Yes. Yes. You have to help other people by helping yourself wearing masks. Exactly. What are some things that you've had to like put on hold or give up during the pandemic? Well, as you know, I'm an actor. Because We're both actors, yeah. yeah. Well, I did get this rule. Yeah, he got a rule in a commercial, and yeah, now... I had to hold it. And they put it on hold, because all productions are on hold right now. And I actually talk about what it's like being an actress, an actor during the pandemic in this video. And I also bake really good chocolate chip cookies in that video. But anyway, yeah, a big sack we have, have had to make is just the whole acting thing. We haven't been able to film anything. But honestly, compared to some people dying in the yeah, hospitals, it's a we, lot worse. Yeah, and even if that. we did did um, film stuff, it was like a long time to get feedback, you know, because like they need it, because they need, they like have all this time before COVID goes. Yeah, through. because during like self tapes and stuff like that for auditions, we're not filming anything for a while, so you don't even know how you did. But obviously, compared to people who are so sick with the virus, that's like nothing. What is one thing that is giving you like hope during the pandemic? Hope that one day, you know, things will be back to normal. Well, it's hard to say. I think the hope is, I know that they'll probably find a vaccine soon. Yeah. And how long do you think it'll take for them to do that? Actually, I think they'll find it pretty soon, like three, four months. And then like at the uh, near, like but probably at like six months, uh, six months from now, probably. Because it takes a while to make the vaccine. Yeah. I mean, they figure out a vaccine that works, but then you've got to make more. Yeah, exactly. You know, because if it works, it's going to get rid of the virus. You literally know more than some people right now. <laughs> Anyway guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope that you enjoyed it and you also enjoyed seeing my brother again for the like fourth or fifth time on my channel. Uh, the link to his uh, channel will be down below so you should go subscribe to him to get more awesome advice. He even has a video on the pandemic and I will link all of these videos and all the videos I've done with him in the past below. Anyway, please subscribe to my YouTube channel before you leave. It would mean so much to me because I do awesome more videos with my brother and also just teen lifestyle videos you know anyway please give this video a like and comment down below to answers for any of the questions that i asked him your opinion on them and anyway do you have anything you would like to say before we leave um no not really except i hope covid goes away yeah pretty simple but anyway that's it for this video i love you guys bye, bye.